Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, in this video, I am going to show you the features and improvements in the new update of Windows 11. Canary Channel, version 24H2, build 26241.5000. So, let's begin. This update includes a small set of general improvements and fixes that will improve the overall experience for insiders running this build on their PC. Starting with the file explorer, drag and drop files with your mouse functionality between breadcrumbs is now available in the file explorer address bar. You can now easily transfer files through different locations on your PC using this feature. There is a small improvement in the taskbar as flashing app icons on the taskbar are now easier to spot. File Explorer also has an improvement. When you have files or folders selected, you will notice a thin border to the selected area which gives the users a better view of the selected file or folder. Next, Microsoft has fixed an underlying issue causing File Explorer to crash when going to home for some insiders in the last few updates. The prompt to disable notifications for certain applications will now appear after a longer period of inactivity with app notifications. Next is the new energy recommendation setting which is to turn off HDR to conserve energy. This setting is disabled by default, but can be enabled manually, if your device is HDR compatible. The company has also fixed an issue where opening settings in Windows Sandbox would show the option to check for Windows updates, but the Windows Update page would be unavailable. Apart from this, Microsoft has converted Copilot into a standalone app into the taskbar, the new app is gradually rolling out to Windows 11 insiders on the beta and release preview channels, and to insiders running Windows 10 on the same channels. The new Copilot is now a web app, like ones you can run with Edge and Chrome. This allows moving and resizing it like a regular Windows app. Its button no longer exists in the tray. The Windows Plus C shortcut is disabled, and it is no longer a system flyout. There are some updates in the release preview channel. Version 24H2. Build 26100.994. The update includes the following features and improvements. Firstly, this update addresses an issue that affects Windows Defender application control. It fails to verify the policies of some apps. Next the issue that affects Windows Defender application control. It reports a certain class of its policies as not active or not authorized. The update addresses an issue that might cause DWM.exe to stop responding. The issue that affects unified write filter, Windows management instrumentation, API calls to shut down or restart a system throws an access denied exception. And lastly, this update addresses an issue believed to be the underlying cause of some insiders, noticing stutters in some animations recently or frame drops particularly with task view. So, that was it, hope it was useful, consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel and if you have any question, just comment down below, thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.